So then, you know Jake Paul, don't you? I mean, everyone knows Jake Paul these days, unfortunately. Uh, he's not exactly the most liked person on YouTube, for various reasons. And um, when people aren't exactly liked around the community of YouTube, uh, one of the things that most of the time happens when someone does something a bit infamous is that they'll get a diss track made about them, usually by Rice Gum. Two months ago, he did just that. I can tell that you came with a Disney flow. Hey, ain't nobody ever heard about your Disney show. Hey. That's kind of his thing, really, Rice Gum. He'll he'll find someone who's not very liked. He'll make a diss track on them, and they'll get even more hate because of them. And I think it's kind of deserved. Let's be fair. Uh, in other news, what's happened is is that. A little YouTuber called KSI, he left the Sidemen, well, I, I think they're footballers or something, and um, he decided to move in with Rice Gum, apparently, and they made a diss track together on the Sidemen. How much wood can a woodchuck chuck if the woodchuck look like you, bitch? I'ma have fun with the nigga here done, you the woodchuck, woodchuck none. Two, in fact. Yeah, bitch, I was to come up. I'm the foundation for you to go well up. Keep playing FIFA, you ignorant fuck. The girl is a gold digger. Fuck. At least she knows how to suck. Oh, shit. Now, I have never followed these YouTubers before, so this drama is just like, whatever to me. Apparently, it's apparently all faked as well, so who am I to know? You see, the thing is, is that a diss track on Jake Paul would make sense because no one likes him. But a diss track on the Sidemen seems a bit suspicious, let's be fair. And now, to add to that, Comedy Shorts Gamer, who is apparently KSI's little brother, he's also made his own diss track on the Sidemen. Fuck the Sidemen, I can't stand them! Literally a bitch made group, I don't rate them! Shit version of Thanos game and I just hate them! I mean, a bit pointless really, your brother already made two. To add to that, uh, with two, what, what, what kind of name's that? Rotor short, oh, Rotor short, apparently. Who the fuck's that? Oh, 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 oh my god! Oh, oh, oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, oh. Okay then. Well, anyway, he went and made his own diss track. I can stand here on my own two feet as I chat shit about you on this old school beat. And now he's also done one on. Comedy Shorts Gamer. How Let's just point this out. There's been two by KSI and Rice Gum. One by uh, Deji, that's Comedy Shorts Gamer. Two by Rotashaw. And get this, it's not over yet. Okay, so apparently, some other of the side men, they've also made their own diss track. And this includes, um... Hold on, I just need to check this, hold on. There's Big Star One Two Three. They say there's a first time for everything, so tell me, Daddy, what the hell were you thinking? Mini Mintar. Now on to another. Your best friend is probably your mother. And Chris MD. I've not been sure since this begun just who to pop off at. So I'll pick, pick everyone. everyone. It's tough seeing the side men torn apart, although I did it first three months ago. I uh, yeah. And they've all made diss tracks. And at this point, I just think, what what is going on? Like, that's like seven diss tracks in the past week or so. I mean, what used to happen was every other month, Rice Gun would upload a new diss track, and then that would be that. But now it's just been complete madhouse. It's YouTube has just become diss track central. And in just like the past hour, I've learned that some guy called Joe Clark or something has made a diss track on Tanner Fox. I have literally no idea who these two people are. This is the first time I'm hearing them. Do you know what? I think I should hop on this trend. I should make my own diss track. Shouldn't I? I should make a diss track on, um... Uh, I don't have beef with anyone, so I can't, can I? But you know what I mean? Why has diss tracking suddenly become this huge thing? It's become a trend. I mean, no one used to make diss tracks apart from Rice Gum and a few people that no one really looked at. They used to be the only ones who made diss tracks. But now it seems like everyone's going to do one. Which is just great. Now, before I go, is there anyone else who's made a diss track? Oh, of course. Fucking Jake Paul. Oh well, now I've got my own diss track. 
brilliant. 